Okay, so this is going to be a quick video on how to pack a tarantula for shipping. And first of all, let's just start off with what you need. You need a box, <laughs> container for the spider to go in, and some paper towel. And yeah, we'll start off by um, getting the container ready. Okay then. Okay, so the first thing I did was I took two sheets of um, the paper towel and slightly dampened it and then folded it so it fitted into the bottom of the container and this will make the base nice and soft for the spider and then I'll um, add in a couple of sheets around the sides and then I'll make the lid to go on top and I'll show you that once I've done it ok then ok so the container is now pretty much ready for a spider I've made a lid and um, Padded out the sides with tissue paper, and there's a nice little area for the spider to go there. This is a good size for um, medium to large terrestrials. And yeah, the, the lid just goes on top like that. And then you put the other lid on, with the actual container. And um, yeah, that's the spider nice and secure in there. So now I'm going to actually get one of my spiders and put it in there to show you how to do that. To show you that it does work. So yeah, let's um, do that next. Okay, so I'm going to use Sophie, my um, Gramacilla species north, or maybe a colourful Medusa, and um, or G. Portery. <laughs> and yeah, I'm going to um, basically just encourage you to go into the container, and to do that, I will use the lid. So yeah, let's see if it works. And it didn't work. <laughs> so yeah, looks like I'm going to need to use both hands. So I'll um, carry on once I've got her in. Okay then guys. Okay, so there she is. Um, she went in quite easily actually. Now what you have to do is add the um, paper towel lid. And uh, it's done. Okay then guys. Okay, so the lid's on and she's ready to go. If you are actually sending out a spider then it's a good idea to um, place a hole in the lid for a bit of ventilation but as I'm not really sending her out then um, it's not really necessary for the few minutes she'll be in there and the next stage is to half fill the box with polystyrene chips or whatever you're going to use then you just need to add the spider and um, fill the box with the um, polystyrene chips or whatever it is you're going to be using to um, pack the box with and you want to make sure you get it around all of the sides and also on top of the container just to um, prevent it from moving around too much in transit and then you're pretty much done so I'll just um, fill the box up so yeah, the um, box is now full, filled with the polystyrene and all that's left to do is to close up the box, tape it up and it's ready to go. It's just important to remember to put the container in the centre of the box or if you've got more than one then to make sure they're not touching the sides where they can't be damaged by other packages that are being sent. And yeah, I think that's about it guys. Okay, so now I thought I'd tell you the reason I made this video and that's because one of my subscribers, Sam, in the UK has decided to um, leave the country and he decided he wanted to send me his um, Mexican red knee tarantula Brachypoma smithy and I'm actually going to be starting a breeding project very soon so I would find another female quite useful but yeah now let's get my G portery back out <laughs> and as you can see she's right buried in the polystyrene chips which is good and when I open the container, chances are she'll just be sitting there, ready to come out. And yep, there she is. Probably hasn't moved since I put her in there. <laughs> Typical G portery. But yeah, hopefully sometime next week I'll be getting a um, B. Smithy female, Mexican Redney. 
So all Sam will have to do, I actually sent him a box already packaged with a container that's already been padded out with tissue paper. So all he has to do is um, add the spider to the centre and put the tissue paper lid back on, close up the container and then put it in the centre of the box and then um, send it to me. So yeah, hope you've enjoyed watching guys and I will see you again soon.